circular convolution example. Okay, let's assume that xn is okay. Let me correct the angle. Okay, xn is equal to two one three. Let's assume this is the starting point, and let's uh, consider the following impulse response or HN five four three two one. Okay. 0, 1, 2, 3, 4. And let's assume that I want to circularly convolve these two sequences with a circular parameter of 6. Okay. Now, my world contains only six time levels. Okay, zero, one, two, three, four, and five. Okay, it's just like uh, regular convolution, but I have a circular. Uh, time and I have six time uh, points. Now we'll place one of these sequences on this time axis, circular time axis. So it's like five, four, okay, here I have three. Two, one, and that's it. Now the other one, just like the regular convolution, we place it uh, on the time axis, and uh, it travels along the time axis. But we have a shift. Uh, sorry, we have a reflection with respect to the origin. So we first start with that. So it's right here, two, one, and three. Okay, so this is my starting point. So my y0 is uh, two times five plus three times one, so 13. Okay, this is my y0. Now, for y1, I shift the x sequence one unit. Okay, so I'm going to draw another circle here. With 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Now, my C x sequence moves one unit to the right, two, one, three, and y one, y one, is now uh, okay. Here I have five. Let me use my blue pen. Five. Four, three. Here there is no overlap, so it is now uh, five plus four times two, eight plus five, thirteen. Okay, this is the same as regular convolution. There is no corruption here. In the first uh, y zero, we have this corrupting term. Okay, if my uh, circular time uh, or if my circular world had seven 
units, then I wouldn't have any corruption. This is a corrupted sample. Corrupted convolution result. But this is fine. This is the same as regular convolution. Okay, so you keep uh, turning around this circle and uh, you determine your circular convolution. Obviously, it will be periodic uh, because you are turning around the circle. And you will some uh, samples, I mean Y0 is uh, corrupted here. And therefore, it is not equal to the uh, regular convolution. But if I had a circular convolution with 7, then I would have obtained the same coefficients as the regular convolution. And um, when I turn around this loop, I would get a periodic extension of the uh, uh, regular convolution in as a result of circular uh, convolution.